three bears. Once upon a time, there were three bears living together in a house of their own in the woods. One of them was a little wee bear. One was a middle-sized bear. And the other was a white big bear. They each had a bowl for their porridge. The little wee bee had a little wee bowl. The middle sized bear had a middle sized bowl. The great big bear and the great big bear had a great big. They each had a chair to sit in. A little wee bear and a little wee chair. A middle sized bear and a middle sized chair. And the great big bear had a great big And they each had a bed to sleep in. A little wee bee and a little wee bit. The middle sized bear and the middle sized bed. And the great big bear and a great big bed. for breakfast. They poured it into their bowls, but it was too hot to eat. And so they decided to go for a walk in the woods until it cold. While well, the three bears were walking. A little girl named Goldilocks came to their house. First, she looked in at the window. And she peeked through the keyhole. Of course, there was nobody inside. So Goldilocks turned the handle of the door. The door was not locked. It was the best for trusted bears. They didn't know any harm in that. Any harm in that. So Goldilocks opened the door and went right in. There was a board on the table. It smells very, very good. Goldilocks didn't stop to think of the board to work. She went straight to it. They said the porch of the great big bear, but it was too hot. And she tasted the porch of the middle sized bear, but it was too cold.
then she says to the porch and then you to be baby. It's neither too hot nor too cold, but just right. Goldilocks liked it so much that she ate it all up. Then Goldilocks went into the parlor to see what else she could There were the three chairs. First, she sat down in the chair of the great big bear. And it was too cold. Then, she sat down in the chair of the little black bear. But it was too cold. Then, she sat down in the chair of the little and the little wee bee. It was neither too hard nor too soft, but just right. Goldilocks liked it so much that she rocked and rocked until the bottom of the chair fell out. Down she went, boom, plump, onto the floor. Goody Rocks went into the bedroom where the three bears slept. First, she went down upon the bed and then of the great big bear. But it was too hard to head for her. Then, she went down upon the bed and then of the black bear. It was too high at the foot for her. Then she went down upon the bed with a little wee bee. It was neither too high at the head nor too high at the foot, but just too light. Goldilocks liked it so much that she covered herself up and grew fast. The bear thought the pods would be cold. So they came home for breakfast. Cold mm -hmm. Rock, so I left the spoon of the great big bear in his boy's pocket. Notice it first thing. Somebody has been tasting my porridge. Said the great big bear in his great big voice. I have this up here. Very much up here. I think this out. I need it all up. Thank you. Thank you. 